This alcoholic beverage is actually a new alcoholic beverage that is made from tofu whey and tofu whey is actually a byproduct that is um, generated from tofu production. There are a few um, positive characteristics of this alcoholic beverage. So firstly, it's environmental friendly because it uses a zero waste method to produce this alcohol. Secondly, it is healthy because it contains antioxidant. And thirdly, it is um, good tasting because of the fermentation process. Tofu whey is actually a byproduct that is commonly overlooked in the tofu industries. We actually have to produce the tofu whey ourselves in the lab. Once we have the whey, we actually um, add sugars and acids to adjust the whey so that the yeast can actually grow well in the whey. After we adjust the whey, we pasteurize it to kill off all the spoilage microorganisms so that the yeast can grow well in the whey. After we pasteurize the whey, we inoculate with the wine yeast that we want to use and we actually incubate in the incubator for about two weeks to produce alcohol. It took me about three months to develop a method from the tofu whey to the soy alcoholic beverage. My research interest is actually in the wine fermentation and food waste management. So this tofu whey project actually falls into these two categories. My PhD supervisor is Associate Professor Liu Sao Chen. He's one of the professors in the NUS Food Science and Technology program. All his PhD students actually focus on flavours and fermentation. So for me, I'm actually working under him on um, fermentation projects. In the past, tofu whey is discharged into the sewage. That means lost opportunity for the companies. By creating a new product from this tofu whey, that means potentially can bring in new revenues for the company and create new job opportunities for people. The main nutritional content in tofu whey and the alcohol beverage made from such tofu whey include isoflavones, calcium, and oligosaccharides. So isoflavones are known to have multiple benefits, particularly for women's health, for example, regulation of the estrogens, osteoporosis, and cancer reduction. This alcoholic beverage contains 7 to 8% of alcohol content and it has a light and refreshing taste that suits many consumers' preference. We are in the process of seeking industry partners either to license other technology or form partnerships or form new companies to further develop, scale up the process and commercialize the product.